Hey everyone, it's Heather Nichols and welcome to the second project that I'm sharing today that was inspired by the 1920s era. This time we're going to combine glitter with the rhinestones to create another just gorgeous sparkly um, rhinestone embellishment. So I'm going to use my sticker machine with this project. If you don't have a sticker machine, use a spray adhesive or a similar something else similar to add something sticky to the surface of your die cut. So you're going to see here that I put sticker adhesive on it, the cardstock, and then I ran it through my die cut machine and I want the front or the top of it to be where the sticker is. And leave the sticker paper on, leave it in your die, and we're going to take our paper piercer this time and mark where we're going to put the rhinestones on our project. Now this time I'm only marking key areas because I'm not going to put every single rhinestone like I did in the previous project. I'm just going to use rhinestones to highlight certain areas of my embellishment. So after I do that, then you're going to remove your cardstock from your die. And remember you left that sticker paper on the front. As you can see, it's the white sticker paper there. And you can see the holes where I marked where I'm going to put the rhinestones. Next, I'm going to peel that sticker paper off, and I can still see where my marks are. Now, if I had used a marker, it would have been on the sticker paper and not on the cardstock. And it's important to have the sticky cardstock for when we add the glitter, and you'll see that. So the, the cardstock is sticky on the front, and now I'm placing my rhinestones where I marked the holes with a paper piercer. And I'm using the larger, kind of the larger and the medium sized rhinestones to place. And I did use a few smaller ones as well. So I'm just going to place those where I marked. You can see the holes. And I'm using that same tool that I used in the previous project. Next, I'm going to dip my die cut piece right into the glitter. So the rhinestones are stuck onto the adhesive that's sticky. And then I'm adding the glitter to it. And look at that. So sparkly, so pretty. Rhinestones and glitter combined, there's nothing better. So let's put our card together with our sparkly and shiny embellishment. I'm using pattern paper from the 1920s kit that was included in the Stamp Affair package. And I'm attaching that to a smoky shadow card base. Next, I stamped a sentiment from the stamp set in the 1920s kit and I also stamped some little things next to it. I'm centering the strip and then I'm going to cut the excess off of the ends. This is a nice way to make sure that you can center something on the front of your card on a long skinny strip. So once I have that done I'm going to add some mini glue dots to the back of this. You can use any kind of adhesive for this. You could run you could have run your piece through the sticker machine at the beginning so you would have adhesive on both sides. After I get the glue dots on, I'm going to position that onto my card front. And then I'm just going to add one more final touch on these little stamped details on each side of the sentiment, just some other tiny little rhinestones. And that finishes off my card. And now it's your time to create an embellishment that combines the use of rhinestones and glitter together on a die cut piece. I can't wait to see what you create and I'm so glad that you could join me today in the 1920s era being inspired by the glitz and glamour of that time. Have a great day everybody.